guys welcome back to my channel simple nail techs on today's show i'll be showing you all the tools that we use for preparing uh for gel or acrylic uh so this is a nail file we use it to file uh the nail bed uh, secondly this is a cuticle pusher we use it to push back the cuticle and this part over here is used to trim off the excess skin um, these are called tips we use them uh, to extend the nail let me show you how they look like this is how they look like uh, you just put glue over here this is the glue that we use you just put the glue over here on the tip and then you put it over on the nail like this and then this is a bowel that we use for sock off you put uh, water, warm water inside. It opens. You put warm water on the inside. Then you close. Then when you're doing your sock off, you just put your your fingers inside like this. Yeah. I'll show you. I'll do a video on demonstrating how uh, a sock off is done. And this is called a UV glaze. I'll also show you how we use it. This is a this is called a dotting tool. Uh, you use it for nail art. These are also brushes that we use for nail art. If you have watched one of my previous videos. Uh, there is a video that I use these brushes on one of my nail arts. Uh, next, this is called a chrome powder. This is also used for nail arting. Let me open it and show you how it looks like. It's a very fine powder and it comes in different colors acrylic liquid it's, it's also called monoma it looks purple in color Let me show you. it actually looks like a uh, spirit but it's called a uh, monoma it has got a very sharp smell so if you are allergic to the smell or any of the products especially this this one the monoma and the powder because they go together you you must always use a mask these two this is a um, monoma and polymer they go together because what you normally do you dip inside a brush over the liquid and then you you dip into the liquid the the powder and then you brush over the nail i will also show you how it's all done next we have got acetone acetone is used to clean off uh, all your brushes when you yeah it's used to clean off your brushes let me show you it's my brush this one you also pour it over uh on a container like this one and then you clean off your brushes because when you're dipping into the powder it normally sticks into the brush so all you need to do is to clean your brushes so that your work is neat at the end up next we have got uh the nail polishes that we use uh 
uh, I've got a Morgan Taylor brand over here and Nail Aqua Nail Aqua uh, brand over here you can obviously use any brand that you like I usually like these ones because they don't uh, dry out when using them so they are perfect but you can use any any brand of your choice up next we have got a cuticle a cutter I mean a cutter yeah not a cuticle cutter but a cutter you use to cut off um, the tips this is used to cut off the tips this is how it's done it should face you like this and then you cut over like this up next we have got the stones these are used for also nail art this is how they look like inside and over here we have got a cat eye magnet this is how it looks like this is also used um, for nail art. I'll also do a video to show you how it's all done. And over here, these are stripping stripes. And also, if you have watched one of my previous videos, uh, I demonstrated on how these these are used. Uh, this is a nail cream this is used when you are done everything so that uh, the nail uh, the hand and the nail and the cuticle it, it looks perfect and shiny because if you don't put the cream uh, what happens is the nail comes out dry so it doesn't actually look nice These are also used for soak off. They actually look like pads inside. To open them, you just clip them like this. You clip them like this. And then uh, you put your finger inside like this. You put all your five fingers inside like this Stop. Toop, 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 toop. these are actually my favorite because they look pretty and the color is pretty this, this is how it looks like this is used for so of course up next we have got primer it's actually clear in color clear clear in color clear liquid this it acts like a bond between your nail and the tip so you put this after you've put the nail the artificial nail and then after then you file off the the the, the artificial nail after that you put the primer because it acts as a bond when putting the product uh we've got uh an orange stick this is also used to uh, push back the cuticle orange stick well, this is powder of course there are different kinds of powders 
there is white uh, there is clear this is white oh i can't open it oh my goodness let me try this one this is pink in color oops this is pink in color this is clear this is clear white clear white in color yep what's next uh a nail clipper of course we all know what a nail clipper is so this is we use it at the beginning when a client have got longer nails we clip them out because if you you don't clip your nails out they they show off here at the back so it doesn't actually look nice yep that's all we've got for today make sure you subscribe and hit the, the notification button for more see you